Guys, I'm gonna be really honest. This was not how I thought I was gonna be starting this episode. There are phantoms outside. This is only our fourth night of not sleeping. But apparently four nights was enough to trigger them. These things are terrifying. Thankfully though, you guys did give me some amazing advice and you said I should use my string to make a bed. Unfortunately, I do not have enough string, but I've got enough for one. So we've got to spend the night hopefully getting some more string. Hopefully it's almost one. Let's see. Let's see where these phantoms are at. Oh my goodness, there he is. Where'd he go? Oh my goodness, does he know we can get th <gasps> Oh, I heard him. Yes, okay. I wonder if I can fight them. Oh my gosh, there's another one right there on our roof. How rude. Okay, let's let's step outside and just see see if we can handle this. Oh my, that is so terrifying. Oh, get away from me. Okay. Ah, <gasps> oh, get away. I mean, that is just the worst. I completely missed that zombie. <laughs> the zon the Arrow from <gasps> no, 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 don't dive at me at the same time. Holy crap. <gasps> they do so much damage. <gasps> goodbye. 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 Oh my gosh. That that's not okay. Okay. <laughs> that's That's a little bit more than I can handle. Ah, come here, buddy. I need your membrane. Oh, he got stuck under the roof. Okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna fight them near a skeleton. That's just asking for trouble. Oh my gosh. Alright, come here, skeleton. Oh, I really should have brought a shield. I'm gonna die if one hits me. <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. In the house. Okay. Huh. Do I have more potato? Oh, I do. Thank goodness. Hello, guys. Come on out. Oh, they're stuck over here. Oh my goodness. You need to get out of here. I have enough on my plate without you. Ah. Their noise is just the creepiest thing. Let's go upstairs. This is what we built this place for. Yeah, perfect. Oh, I couldn't reach him. Come on down, buddy. You know you want to. Oh, I got him! I don't think he dropped a membrane. No, he didn't. Okay, we just have one more left to kill. And I actually don't see any spiders, which is really unfortunate. All right, come here, baddie. I'm getting good at this zombie killing thing. I think the last phantom got lost. <laughs> oh, nope, he's not lost. I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. Oh, this is terrifying. Die. Does it have to be raining right now as well? Okay. Oh, he dropped iron. Thank you. Okay. Where's this phantom guy? Oh, he's stuck in my house. Hello. I'm over here. Oh, he knows. Okay. That, ah, that's like a literal jump scare. What? Oh, and, okay, this is not what I needed. I do not need bubbles right now. Hello, hello, oh, there he is, oh, I got him! I think, oh, nope, didn't get him, did not get him, never mind. False alarm, let's eat some zombie flesh. Man, I was in the process of farming when this guy spawned. This is just rude, guy, please. Man, you can only hit them once when they come down. There's a creeper over there, I need to remember that. Okay, here he comes again. We're gonna get him this time. Maybe, maybe not. Oh, ah! He's actually not been too hard to handle so far. They hit really hard, but we have iron armor, so we're we've been okay. As long as they don't sneak up on you, I think that's kind of the trick. Oh my goodness, he has so much health though. Yeah, these phantoms have a lot of health. Oh, there are so many. This may be a little bit more than we can handle. Maybe we should... Oh, oh, ah. Oh. 
Well, um, please go away. I don't have time for you two. Oh, yes, I killed him. He didn't drop a membrane either. It must be so rare. Okay. Gosh, my sword is gonna die. Oh, I need a bow. Do I have anything? Do I have any arrows? I don't. Ugh, I don't have any feathers either. Nope, nothing. Okay. We are just gonna have to make this work. Ah! Oh my gosh! <sighs> Get- Die! Please! That is rude! You do not come at someone's door like that. That is just- that was so rude. And there's a baby zombie on a chicken. Of course there's a baby zombie on a chicken. Why wouldn't there be a baby zombie on a chicken right now? I mean, we don't have enough problems. You know, he doesn't actually care about us. <laughs> Not in the slightest. All right, come here, phantom. I've had enough of you. Every time, every time I stand there, I swear. I really can't afford to get hit again though. How's my armor? Okay, my armor's fine. Come on, dive at me. I can take you. Okay, thank goodness morning is coming and lots of spiders spawned. That is perfect. That's exactly what we need, string. Huh. Well, this has been an eventful fourth night. Hello, phantom? Oh, goodness, get off my roof. Where did he go? Gosh. Come here, spider. I need you to drop lots of string for me. Thank you very much. Okay, he's gonna start burning up very soon. Hmm. Well, good riddance. Okay, you're gonna start burning up very soon, too. Come here. What a rough night. Oh, we got a membrane! Yes, that is awesome. All right, let's go inside and heal up a little bit. And then we'll go deal with those spiders and see if we can't get some cool stuff. Oh, that is awesome. That's going to be so useful when we get Elytra. That's so exciting. Okay, we have three more string. We need, um, we need five more. Come here, Spidey. You're going to give me some string, right? Right? No. Not right. All right, well, that's just rude. We've got another two over here, though, so there's a chance. <gasps> yep, okay, perfect. That's exactly what I need. I need two string from you as well, please. Yep, just one. All right, well, that is a fantastic start. Actually, we do have seven now. Okay, that's awesome. We only need one more piece of string. Let's go turn that into wool, and maybe when we go caving, we can find the last piece. Is Goodness knows, I do not want to have another night like that one. That was rough. All right, so I've constructed a little cow pen here for us, and now I am just gonna go over here and quickly grab the cows that I saw in the last episode. So we are gonna need leather super soon if we want to make an enchanting table, so we gotta get this cow farm going. Hello, cows, I have a snack for you. Is that everybody? Come on. Need all of you. All right, so now that we are done with the phantoms, we've got some cows collected together. We can start breeding those. Our farm is doing just so fantastic. I mean, it's definitely more than enough to sustain us at this point. I've got some potatoes cooking up, and once those are done, I'm just gonna head down underground and we're gonna see if we can finally get our hands on some diamonds. I'm gonna show you guys where I'm mining in just a second. Okay, we've got that. Let's also just make some bread. Lots of food options. Yep, that should be do it. Let's clean out our inventory real fast. Goodness. Need a little more string. I'm gonna make a bed underground, probably. There we go. Oh my goodness, we did have arrows! Ah. <laughs> I must be going blind. Alright, and in terms of wood, we may want to take something down. I'll just grab up some birch wood before we go. Ooh, and uh... I should probably take make another sword real fast. So we're definitely gonna be fighting some baddies down there. There we go. 
Okay, so now that I've got all of my supplies ready, I'm just gonna hop in this cave down right here. Now, I fell down here before and did a little bit of mining, but I saw that it went really deep, so I decided I wanted to take you guys along with me down here. What I'm hoping is that this cave goes all the way- Oh, okay. I'm gonna need you to die before you- No, I was hoping you would die before you that happened. No! Creeper! Oh, that's so rude. All right, well, at, I mean, at least our spawn point is right here. <laughs> I hope our stuff didn't explode, but I mean, all we had was food, so <laughs> it probably wasn't that important anyways. Goodness me. All right, thankfully, I did leave a couple of my stone tools in there. So I'm just gonna use these. Hopefully, I can get down to safety super fast. I can't believe I got blown up by a creeper. How incredibly rude. Okay. Oh, goodness. Okay, there's all my stuff. Yes! Oh, I got it back. Okay. Thank goodness. Gosh. That was stressful. Okay. I... Where's my helmet? Oh, dear. Okay. I have my torches. My sword. My axe. Alright. Get rid of that. Oh, there's my helmet. Well, looks like we didn't actually lose much. Now, we just need to not die again, because that wouldn't be good. No! Oh, don't scare me like that. Stop it. God, these zombies are so rude lately. All right, let's go this way. Oh, it's another skeleton. Okay, come here, buddy. I can handle you. We should definitely look into making a shield. These skeletons are so, so <gasps> not you again. Die, 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 no! <gasps> okay, that's not how you fight a creeper. Note to self, note to self. That's, that's not how it's done. I'm gonna quickly, while we're safe, I'm gonna quickly look into making a shield because I think we definitely need one of those. <laughs> Ugh. Badly. So, there we go. No more deaths. No more deaths for Gemini Tay. And that would be a dead end. And that's a dead end. All right, let's go back the other way. I'll take that. Oh yeah, it looks like it gets super deep over here. All right, I'm gonna spend some time in here, get some coal, get some resources, and I will be back with you if something exciting happens. Look what I see down there, we've got diamonds. I've just been caving up in this area and I happened to fall down into this hole, but it, it was a lucky fall. Our luck, I think, is turning around. What do you guys think? Uh, let's see how many we got here. All right, we got two. That's not bad, so that means we need one more to make a pickaxe, and I'm hoping we can get one somewhere down here. Oh no, the cave's going back up. That's not a good sign. All right, so I'm gonna keep poking around. Oh, hello, baby. Ah, oh, that was a bad block. There we go. Ah, die. Thank you. Whoa, where did you come from? What the heck? All right, let's uh, let's hop up here and just see what's going on. Oh, pickaxe! Oh, <laughs> derp! I don't think there's anything in here. Mm, is this a ravine? Oh my goodness! <gasps> Literal jump scare! What? Stop falling out of the dark like that! What? That's so rude! Goodness! <laughs> this is called like the episode of scaring Gemini. This goodness me! This episode is literally just how many jump scares can we give Gemini? Because, oh, get away! Go away! I need to eat. I need to eat in peace. I did not mean to build those things. That was called panic building. Go away! Get out of here! Ah! Gosh! Okay, do not look at that Enderman. Oh. <sighs> What an eventful caving episode. <laughs> I never thought caving could be so scary and eventful. What the heck? I think we may have found an underwater cave right here. Yeah, this is definitely an underwater cave and it goes, it goes to diamond level. 
But I don't have any good water breathing stuff, so we're gonna have to come back to this spot to actually explore it. Let's break through into here. Yeah! Wow, this is all filled with water. What the heck? There must have been lava there. That's so cool. What's up here? Oh! Alright. I see you. You know what? You can... You can stay. You can... You could stay up there. It's it's fine. I'll leave you alone. <laughs> this is fine. Now that is what I like to see. I need more of this going on. I'm so convenient. Why can't that happen all the time? <laughs> All right, and after a long day and night, it appears, of mining, I finally returned to the surface. And I see we have got a lot of growth up here. I guess that is the perks of caving right below the island here. All right, so this is what I have come up with. I've got lots of iron, so a little bit of gold. I've managed to get 10 diamonds, which is perfect because it means we're going to be able to get obsidian right now for another portal. Lots of lapis and a good amount of coal. I still need to go back down and get some of the coal and iron that I left behind, but my inventory just got way too full. I also unfortunately did not get enough string, which is sad, but we can get some obsidian right here, and I'm gonna do that as soon as possible. First though, I'm gonna dump off my inventory and see if we can hopefully kill a spider and get our bed. All right, let's see if we can find any spiders. Oh, it is looking dangerous over there, especially now that we've lit up those caves. There are not many spots for things to spawn anymore because a lot of those caves down there are underwater caves. I actually was cut off quite a few times by underwater caves and ravines, which is gonna be great as soon as we have enough gear to deal with that. Die, creeper. Whoops, sorry, piggy. So sorry. Oh, I see a spider. I really hope he drops string. Come here, spider. I need you. Yes. Please. Oh, yes. String. At last, we can finally sleep. Oh, I'm so excited for this moment. Wool. And now, our bed. Perfect. Let's go get a good night's rest. Goodness. Ha! Huh, sweet dreams. All right, I've just got back from farming. We now have so much food, finally. I mean, we're doing great. We're doing great in terms of wheat. We got tons and tons of sugar cane so that we'll be able to create our bookshelves. And I think now that we've got that going, why don't we take a little look at this buried treasure map and see where we need to go. So it looks like it's going to be on an island, probably one of these islands around us. Okay, we're moving up it now, so we need to go over this way, it looks like. Let's try that out. Ooh, I should have brought a boat. I have a boat over there. It's fine. I'll make another one. We'll probably be needing lots of boats throughout this series since we are living on islands after all. All right, let's get going. Hmm, okay. Oh, just look at the coral. How crazy inspiring. I absolutely love that tree out there as well. I think eventually we need to build our own tree in place of that one. Have it be this big, epic oasis tree. I think that would be a lot of fun. What do you guys think? How are we doing? Okay, so we've made it down to the corner. I'm not entirely sure how to work these maps, if I'm being honest. Oh, whoa, look at that shipwreck. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. All right, I feel like we're a little further away. Maybe, maybe I, maybe we need to go this way. I think I need to look into how to use these maps better. All right, so with this treasure map, it looks like we're gonna have to go this way right here. So let's get paddling. This is also a really good chance for us to explore these coral reefs. I want to see what's around here so badly. I'm like itching just to get out. All right, let's see. Maybe this way a little more. Ah. So we're traveling this way and we're going up it. How do we go? Hmm. 
Man, these maps are hard to use. How do we figure these things out? I need some advice in the comments section. Help me out, guys. <gasps> here it is. It's this island over here. Okay, we found it, finally. Here we go. This big sandy island surrounded by these gorgeous coral reefs. Okay. Yes. It looks like it's going to be on this side right here. Yep. Oh, is there a shipwreck on this one as well? There is according to the map. I can't even see it from here. Oh, there is! Oh, and some underwater ruins! We have so much to explore. Okay, I need, a, I need to make a shovel. I can't believe I didn't even make a shovel before I came here. I was just in such a rush to leave. I didn't wait for any of my food either. <laughs> I'm so silly about food. I keep just completely forgetting about it. Luckily, I brought lots of wheat and we have so much wheat at home, so. We're fine with that. All right, where is this treasure gonna be? It looks like it might be in here somewhere. All right, let's start digging, I guess. Oh, there it is. That was so easy. Oh my gosh, there's so much loot. We got a heart of the sea. That is gonna be so important for us building underwater. And some food, prismarine, yes. I am so excited to get my hands on more prismarine. That's just got me so excited. All right. This was some really good loot in there actually. Okay, let me just quickly break this chest. And then I want to explore that shipwreck over there. Man, we have got so much exploring to do. And so little time. The sun is going down again. Goodness, these days just get away from me. All right, let's 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 just pop in here real fast. See what we can find, shall we? Hmm. Maybe, maybe we should uh, craft up a little axe real fast. That'll make things go a little smoother. There we go. Here's the first one. Okay, some carrots. Oh, poisonous potatoes. I don't actually want to take those with me. I'm loving the spruce trap doors as well. Okay, what else is in here? I think that might actually be all of it. Let's break through here, I guess, and see if there's anything inside. Doesn't look like it, though. Let me put down a torch for you guys. Not, not seeing anything. All right, I think this was just a small little shipwreck anyways. Yeah. Oh, look at this landscape. Another thing that you guys were really helpful about in the comments was telling me that I could actually eat kelp. So I think what I'm going to be doing is harvesting a little bit of kelp for us to eat as well, because I think that'll be really good for us in this early game alongside of our crops that we've got going. So I don't want to take too much wheat away from our cows, especially once we start getting a much larger cow farm going. So thank you guys so much for all of your amazing comments. You've been so helpful and supportive with this series, and I'm so, so grateful. <laughs> doing survival is so far out of my comfort zone, but it's definitely something that I've been excited to do with you guys, so thank you. Apparently this is our new boat parking spot. I regret all of this. <sighs> okay, um, there's a lot of creepers on my island. Um, all right, let's, let's go sleep, shall we? I, I really don't want to be awake right now. Okay, I think it's time to put some of our diamonds to use. We have 10 of them. So I'm gonna use three of them right now and craft a little pickaxe for us. And then we're gonna go get some obsidian so that we can create an enchanting table as well as a nether portal. Uh, what do we need? I need a bucket of water. Oh, I already have a bucket of water. Why didn't anybody tell me? Alrighty, I think that should be plenty of obsidian for our needs right now. Um, let's go put this to use, shall we? So first off, I want to create another portal. Now where we put this right now is not going to be its final spot. This, what's happening right now is really the basic stuff that we need. We're gonna soon start on our main base, which is gonna be on this island. And that's gonna be much, much bigger and largely underwater as well. So once we start on that, things will look a little cleaner. But for right now, I think we've got enough stuff to get us going. All right, perfect. And there is our nether portal. 
that is a beautiful sight. I haven't been to the nether in so long. I'm so excited, but we're not gonna go through there right now. Instead, I'm gonna keep breeding up these cows and then get my enchanting table going. All right, let's get our next two diamonds. I've got a piece of leather for the book. Book right there on the top two diamonds and then four pieces of obsidian and enchanting table perfect i'm gonna just lay this upstairs for now we're gonna surround it by books very soon but i've got to do some more farming to do that all right guys thank you so much for watching i am just quickly going to pick out a comment of the day to read out all right this one says i'm so excited can this series last a while question mark exclamation mark well in short Yes, of course it can last a while. It can last so long as you guys are interested in it. I know the last time I did a series, I did not continue it for too long. My last Let's Build series was very short, but my channel was also very small, and I was very, very inexperienced. Since then, I have learned so much about time management and scheduling, and I'm gonna be a lot more organized about this series. I'm definitely not gonna just randomly give up on it partway through, so don't worry about that. This series is going to be here for as long as you guys like it to be. Anyways, with that, I'm going to get back to my farming. You guys go play in your 1.13 worlds. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.